Alright, what's up guys? Alright, some more of this uh, Brave Frontier. Welcome back guys, welcome back. Faye here once again with uh, another <clears throat> uh, playthrough of how well this Mono Fire team is going to be. Now, um, I know this is kind of repetitive, and I do say this a lot, <clears throat> but this is really for those people um, that are just unlucky, I guess, with the rolls, uh, like me. I kind of screwed up with my rolls and oh, for my main. Uh, didn't really get any good units. And honestly, the best role is probably to get um, a good leader. And then once you get a good leader, to have like uh, basically uh, rolling, um, what is it, a mono element team. So if you get similar uh, elements and then you have a good leader, then you're pretty much set. If you have like at least three, if you have at least three, then that's that's a pretty, pretty strong team. But yeah, so this is for those people that failed <laughs> making a decent team. And uh, they've gotten so far ahead into the game that, you know, you just don't want to start over. Or or you guys could start over. Um, it's really up to you. I do have a guide on that and um, starting over. Uh, it's really not that hard, guys. All you have to do is just make a, a new one. Make a new Facebook account. And then <clears throat> you'll have to play a guest. But you guys can go check out my reroll guide. And that's going to be helpful. <laughs> and, you know, just keep playing your main. And, um, and then uh, keep re-rolling until you get uh, a pretty, pretty good unit. So I ended up picking Sophia, which is probably the best unit in the game as of now. So I'm very satisfied. And uh, she's also Anima, which is the best type. So from there, I just started building my fire team, since I actually have a good unit. Um, I really doubt I'm going to do any rare summons. I really don't want to. I feel like the minute I do it, I'm not going to have any desire of playing the game, because seriously, the, the rare summons. Um, when you have like horrible rare summons, and no matter no matter how freaking lucky you are, you're always going to have a couple of crappy units. It's just bound to happen. Um, it's, just, it's just the way they made the game. And if they didn't, if they didn't, then no one would be spending money on this game. This is basically, um, I forgot what they call them. Um, but freeism? No, free it. I always, I always forget. There's a term for this, uh, where like a game is for free, but, um, in a way, you're not meant to pay, but um, but for you to get pretty far into the game, um, you're gonna get to that. You're gonna get to that point where it requires you to purchase some microtransaction in order to get to the next step. In order for you to get to the next level, you have to spend that money. Oh yeah, but this is our last battle right here. Um, seriously, going through the first couple of waves are ridiculously easy, and I don't, I didn't even mean to do this, but I ended up getting the five star, um, uh, Vargas, the Fire God, which is the five star version. So I might have a good time, but I might not. The AOE hurt quite a bit. Um, I'm not gonna spend the cure. Let's see what happens. <clears throat> I think I have to spend a couple cures in this one. Oh my gosh. Holy cow. Oh man. Definitely have to spend the cures, man. I'm not sure if I can finish it with just this. With just this many people. But his AoE is not hurting too bad. If I spent the cure earlier, I think I would have definitely had an easier time. But I'm gonna... Oh, sh I don't know. I don't know. Right now, cure is not really that expensive. So I'll, I'll spend it. I'll spend it and we'll see what happens. But this is gonna probably take me like 3 or 4 turns right here. Okay, the odd... Oh my god, I forgot to, I forgot to cure. I was trying to cure. I ended up autoing instead. 
Ooh, that AoE is not going to be good. Okay, okay. Alright, it's not too bad, actually. Luckily, because I have that 5-star, it's really helping out in damage-wise. And we're able to take this boss down. Uh, just for safe measures, let's just go ahead and heal him. Wow, guys. I'm pretty speechless. You guys saw it firsthand on my channel. A fake king, I did it. We did it. We did it. Gosh, guys, you saw how ridiculously... Alright, no. Okay, we can't say that it was ridiculously easy, but it was... Um, it wasn't as challenging as I thought it was. I, I definitely thought I was not going to be able to kill him on the first try. But we actually came through, even though I was like, what, like three units down. I only had the last three. Um, and we didn't, we didn't spend all the gems. I had one left over. So that was actually a pretty decent run coming from the mono team gosh but that really shows how strong it is and that right there I had 25% from my leader and I had a full 50% because that's a five star anything that's a four star or five star um, if they have anything with elemental boost it's always going to be 50% so that was 75% that's not bad and I also had Sophia on the team so it wasn't a full fire either Bet if it was the full fire, I probably did even better. And plus, two of my Leons are only level 5. And uh, I don't know what the other low one is. But I know my Vargas is level 20. I mean, none of them are maxed out. That That's all, all I'm trying to say. I ended up beating this with what? Um, three, two stars. Two, three stars. And one five star. That was a friend. I'm sure he probably had a pretty big impact on it. Somewhat. But I feel like if I played it right, I kind of, I, I really kind of fucked up there. I, like, I didn't cure at the right time. I probably could have saved a couple units, got some more damage in. Um, so I say it, it wasn't all because of that 5 star. Can't say that. And I've played it before. 5 stars do make a little bit of a difference. But it's not too huge. It's not too drastic. Because I think that would be a little too un un unbalanced. It would be a little too unbalanced. If you really think about it, if you calculate it, it's 1 out of 6. 1 out of 6 is really not that big. I mean, 1 out of 5, I, I, don't, I can't do the calculus right now. But 1 out of 5 is like 20%. So, 1 out of 6 is less than 20%. And 20% is pretty, pretty small. But yeah, so we're finally on the second map. Which is nice. I say the only bad part about this is you do spend a little bit of time. You probably spend maybe like um, like a day or so, a couple days farming the units, but um, I definitely think it's worth it. I think I'll be able to beat this whole game, and then I'll also be able to go on to the uh, the other map. You know how there's three maps, and then there's another map that you can get to, and that one's pretty challenging. So. I think it'll be all right. Sorry for the noise if you guys hear it. I can hear it. If I could, then I'm sure you guys could as well. But that is my dog barking outside. But yeah, so we only spent nine cures. And literally, that was like the first time um, me ever spending any cures in this game. Seriously. All right, so the in the beginning of oh, this fire... This is going to be easy. <clears throat> now, I'm definitely going to hit a brick wall. I can anticipate this. I'm going to probably hit a brick wall on um, on the water area for sure. I know that for sure. Okay. I mean, this is the second level. Goblins aren't really doing much. And uh, you do see the new the dogs. Um, 
the Orthus, and they don't do much either. They actually, they actually just, they just get melted. They just get melted. Yeah. I remember when I played this on my main. Um, you could definitely see a difference between the first one and the second one. But um, here, uh, so I'm having a, a lot easier time. Oh, wait, it's our first spirit, guys. It's our first spirit. Now, let's see if we can get through the spirit. Mm. Oh, no, 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 no. I actually missed one. That's not bad. That's really not bad. Going through half the life of a spirit is actually pretty good. And then I kind of fucked up with the, uh, you might have to heal him. Got unlucky there. But like I said, these lead on are freaking level two. Yeah, see, if I got him with a spark, um, we could have taken him out in, in two turns. Which would have been better. Okay. Ooh, there we go. We just took out the Leon. We took out the Leon in one turn. That was that was no joke. And you know, Goblin doesn't really stand a chance. Not against this team. Uh, I don't know. If I struggle, if I really do struggle, and I do highly predict. I am, um, I don't know, like 75%, no, like 90% sure that uh, water is going to freaking be hard. Um, but if it's not, then this could possibly work for all elements. But the areas do get harder as they go. So, um, like, as in order. So the easiest will be fire. And then water and earth and lightning. Thunder is the hardest out of all of them. The units are really, really hard. They, they hit hard. Uh, earth is pretty easy, I guess. Even though if they are stronger. But earth, you have an easy time with earth. Okay, I'm kind of struggling with the boss here. Uh, I think he's as hard as the, uh, as the first boss. I'm having some um, difficulty... Oh my god, that did hardly any damage. Yeah, missing out on a unit is really bad. Oh my god. And I'm dying. Okay, I can't be stingy. I can't be stingy with the uh, with the cures. <laughs> Definitely. <clears throat> it's just going to make me spend more cures, which is bad. Okay, but this Leon could actually tank, though. Because I, I actually leveled him up a little bit. The first one. Yeah, I'm definitely wasting more cures than I have to. Wow. Wow, he just one-shotted the Vargas. Which is bad. I don't think we can survive this. I don't know. It's going to take another two turns. And if he does another PB like that, I'm definitely just going to flat-out die. Oh my god, if he takes him out, this is going to be impossible. Okay, so... Please let the poison proc... Oh my god, if the poison proc it would have been good. But either way, he's not doing his PB this turn, which is going to give us, uh, which is going to secure the win for us right here. Nice. Alright, that was a good, that was a good, uh, that was a good run, guys. We did it, and <clears throat> so far I haven't used any Metal Ghost, um, so I haven't used any of that yet. I've been constantly, uh... Mm. See, these are good, but you can see the recovery. Recovery is really crappy. So, yeah. I mean, recovery is not an important stat, but it's, uh... It's definitely not bad. I mean, it's not bad to have, you know? what? What is bad to have? Okay, dude, I'm having some issues here, so I might have to... Do some leveling. The uh, leveling here. Okay, so my Leon, the first one, that one's level 22, and the rest of them are level 5. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and level the rest of them. My Vargas was level 20, and he's still struggling a pretty good bit. 
So yeah, I'm probably gonna level them up a little bit, and then I'll see you guys in a bit, alright? Sorry about the dog. I don't know why my dog's barking so much. But yeah, I, got, I guess I gotta cut it short because of my dog. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and, uh, and as always, uh, I appreciate you guys for watching. Thanks for the support.